This is from the Orlando Sentinel. 36-year-old Jacksonville, Florida man is accused of performing a, a sex act on himself while driving south on I-95 near Ormond Beach. Uh, Dawn, you may not want to hear this. Um, I don't know how you can avoid it. Ronald Ayers was charged with indecent exposure on Wednesday. He denied performing the sex act. He said another driver who reported him to authorities misunderstood what he was doing while driving. Said he was using drumsticks to hit his steering wheel. He's a drummer. He told deputies he's a drummer who commutes between Jacksonville and Daytona Beach. He frequently simulates playing the drums while driving by hitting his steering wheel with the drumsticks. So what happened was a woman from Flagler Beach called authorities at 8 o'clock Wednesday morning and said that a driver, later identified as this guy, was performing a sex act on himself while driving a Chevrolet Astro van. Dawn, a question. If you were driving I-95 and you saw a guy who you thought was performing a sex act, would you call 911? Would you call the authorities? Snur you don't think you'd notice. Now stop and think. This woman, this guy claims he's playing the drums. He's got his drumsticks on the steering wheel. She thinks she's watching a sex act. Snurdly, you're driving along I-95, next door, a guy or a woman, whatever, you think performing a sex act, would you call 911? Brian, would you call? I wouldn't call 911. Now, it would never occur to me. Well, it doesn't say he was driving a rash. He was in his Astro van and uh, Chevrolet Astro van. Oh, by the way, you seen General Motors news? General Motors is is now, it's a mess. Uh, it's, it's lost more money than what we paid to bail him out now. Classic. Cla and you hate it. Nobody wants to see General Motors decay like this. He did not save him. Obama didn't save anything. He doesn't say he will, he will not save anything. Anyway, back to the drumstick guy here. Well, just sit tight here. If you just hang in, I'm going to explain how you drive a car by uh, playing drumsticks uh, on the uh, steering wheel. The woman said she was driving alongside the Chevrolet Astro van in which the guy was playing the drumsticks. She called the authorities. She gave the authorities the guy's tag number, and she followed him until the authorities pulled him over. When a Volusia County deputy approached the Astro van, he spontaneously explained he was hitting drumsticks against his steering wheel as he drove. He invited the deputy to search the Astro van. The deputy did and found two sets of wooden drumsticks between the two front seats. The drumsticks were a natural wood color, and they closely resembled Ayers' own skin color, says the report. The deputy re-interviewed the woman and asked if it was possible that she confused Ayers' drumming for a sex act, and she was adamant. She had a clear view of his penis. She stated it was not possible she mistook the drumsticks for his penis. She said she wanted to pursue criminal charges. She completed a sworn written statement detailing what she said she saw. I've seen drumsticks and I've seen the penis. And believe me, I know the difference, particularly when I'm looking at them in an Astro van driving on I-95. It's uh, the Orlando Sentinel.